Many of you in this room have been the brains behind many of the judicial payments and services we now have in Ethiopia. And I want to particularly recognize here your initiative, your innovation in this space. Supportive policies, digital infrastructure and ecosystem players has in the past led to a tremendous explosion in the use of digital payments. To highlight just a few of these impressive gains in this area, the volume of digital transactions have overtaken cash transactions for the first time in 2023. In the first half year, uh, half year of 2023, more than 920 million transactions were effected with a value of close to 4 trillion per. We project to close the financial year at more than 6 trillion per in value transacted through existing digital channels. Most utility payments, fuel payments, government to people payment are now digital. So given all these impressive growth trends, it's clear that we have come a long way so far as a country, and I would like to congratulate all of you, especially the innovators and the on-ground implementers for the collective success. While a lot has been accomplished, much more remains to be done. We need to collectively build on the successes of the digital payment ecosystem we have so far, but also make it even go even further. First, we need to expand access to those who are still not part of the digital payment system. The effort of banks, MFIs, mobile money operators, and telecom companies will continue to be needed in this area. Second, we need to ensure digital payment systems serve not just the function of facilitating payments from one person to another, but also help address a broader range of credit and other financial services needed by the population. In this regard, we all need to be innovative in ensuring that digital payment systems facilitate loans, insurance, investments, and a whole array of such financial products, and all of this especially to underserved and unserved part of our communities. Third, as regulators, we have the responsibility of ensuring that our laws and actions promote fair competition for all actors. More broadly, in terms of the broader digital payment ecosystem, I believe we will also need to address the issue of privacy and security. Together, we can harness the transformative power of digital financial services to build a more inclusive and prosperous future for all Ethiopians. Mm -hmm.